Wholemeal bread is a healthful source of complex carbs. There is conflicting information out there about carbs. Studies have shown that low-carb diets are effective for weight loss, but that doesn't mean that eating carbs makes you fat. In fact, there are plenty of health benefits associated with eating carb-containing foods, but that's only if you eat the right kinds. While some high-carb foods are highly nutritious and even helpful for weight management, others are detrimental to your health. What are carbs? Carbohydrates, or carbs, are one of three macronutrients that provide the body with energy. The other two are protein and fat. There are three major classes of carbs. Sugars individual sugar molecules are short chains of sugar molecules. These include glucose, fructose, galactose and sucrose starches longer chains of carbohydrate molecules that need to be broken down in the digestive system. Fiber carbohydrates that the body cannot digest The primary function of carbs is to provide the body with energy. Most carbs are broken down into glucose in the digestive system and provide the body with fuel to perform essential functions. Each gram of carbs provides the body with 4 calories. The exception to this is fiber, which generally does not provide many calories. Bottom line carbohydrates are a macronutrient that provides the body with energy. Carbs include sugars, starches and fiber. Not all carbs are created equal Part of the reason there is so much confusion regarding carbs is that not all carbs are created equal. People tend to classify all carbs as either good or bad, but that doesn't make sense. There are major differences in the health effects of different types of carbs, so they cannot all be lumped into one group. One way that carbs are classified is by the terms simple and complex. Some people define all starch and fiber as complex carbs and all sugars as simple carbs. However, this definition can be confusing. Some starchy foods like sweet potatoes, quinoa and legumes provide many health benefits, while other starch sources like refined wheat flour are associated with a myriad of health problems. Additionally, not all sugars have the same effect on your body. Added sugars like those found in baked goods and sugary drinks can harm your health 1, 2, 3, 4. However, the natural sugars found in whole fruits and vegetables do not have the same negative effects. It makes more sense to define complex and simple carbs this way. Complex carbs Carbs found in whole, unprocessed foods, including fruits, vegetables, legumes and whole grains. Simple carbs Sugars and starches that have been refined and stripped of their natural fiber and nutrients. Bottom line Complex carbs are found in whole, unprocessed foods. Simple carbs are found in processed foods and have little nutritional value. Complex carbs are highly nutritious, but simple carbs are not brown rice versus white rice. Complex carbs are healthier than simple carbs because they are generally nutrient-dense. This means they contain a large amount of nutrients in relation to the number of calories they provide. Whole grains, fruits, vegetables and legumes are highly nutritious foods that are rich in antioxidants, fiber, vitamins and minerals. On the contrary, simple carbs contain empty calories, meaning they have calories, but very little nutritional value. To highlight the nutritional differences between complex and simple carbs, let's compare whole grains and refined grains. A whole grain contains three distinct parts, germ part of the seed, that's high in polyunsaturated fats and various important nutrients, endosperm, the inner portion of the grain, that's mostly made up of starch, bran, the hard. Outer portion of the grain that's high in fiber and essential fatty acids the German bran of a grain are where the majority of its nutrition is found. Interestingly, when grains are processed and refined, the highly nutritious German bran are removed, leaving only the starchy endosperm. Below is a comparison of the nutritional content of 1 cup 120 grams of whole wheat flour and 1 cup of refined wheat flour 5, 6 whole flour refined flour calories 407,455 carbs 87 grams 95.4 grams protein 16.4 grams 12.9 grams fat 2.2 grams 1.2 grams fiber 14.6 grams 3.4 grams thiamine percent RDI 36 percent 10 percent riboflavin percent RDI 15 percent 0% niacin percent RDI 38% 8% vitamin B6% RDI 20% 8% folate percent RDI 13% 8% pantothenic acid percent RDI 12% 5% iron percent RDI 26% 8% magnesium percent RDI 41% 7% phosphorus percent RDI 42% 13% potassium percent RDI the 14% 4% zinc percent RDI 23% 6% manganese percent RDI 200 
128%, 43% selenium%, percent, RDI 121%, 61% choline 37.4 mg, 13 mg whole wheat flour is a source of several important nutrients, but those nutrients are lacking in wheat flour that has been processed and refined. The same is true for fruits and vegetables. In their whole forms, they contain small amounts of sugar, but they are also packed with vitamins, minerals and fiber. On the other hand, processed foods and sugary beverages contain large amounts of sugar and few nutrients. These added sugars are associated with all kinds of health problems 1, 2, 3, 4. Bottom line complex carbs, such as whole grains, fruits, vegetables and legumes, are highly nutritious. Simple carbs provide calories, but little nutritional value. Health benefits of complex carbs Carbs are not essential for life, but eating the right kind may benefit your health. Complex carbs are less likely to cause blood sugar spikes. Simple carbs are digested very quickly, which causes a spike in your blood sugar. The blood sugar spike stimulates your pancreas to release a large dose of insulin, which often leads to a blood sugar crash, leaving you hungry and craving more sugar. 7. 8. Fibric complex carbs take much longer to break down than simple carbs. This helps keep blood sugar levels steady, as sugar reaches the bloodstream gradually. 9. 10. Because complex carbs are digested more slowly, they provide sustained energy and help you feel full for longer. 11. Complex carbs may reduce your risk of some chronic diseases. Consuming complex carbs may help lower your risk of chronic diseases, such as diabetes and heart disease. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. They tend to be high in dietary fiber, vitamins, minerals, antioxidants and plant compounds. All of these components play a role in disease prevention 18, 19. Furthermore, studies have found that eating whole foods high in dietary fiber may lower bad LDL cholesterol and blood sugar levels, as well as help raise good HDL cholesterol 20, 21, 22. Complex carbs promote a healthier digestive system There are billions of good bacteria lining your intestines. They're known as your gut microbiota. They play a role in managing several digestive disorders and have been linked to various other aspects of health 22, 23, 24. Soluble fibers found in complex carbs feed the beneficial bacteria and increase their presence in your gut. They also help the bacteria produce nutrients, such as short-chain fatty acids, which are beneficial for digestive health 23. Complex carbs may reduce inflammation. Inflammation is the body's natural response to infection or injury. However, long-term inflammation can increase the risk of several chronic diseases. 25. While sugary foods and refined flours promote inflammation, complex carbs help reduce inflammation. 26. Whole grains, fruits, vegetables and legumes contain fiber and plant compounds that have anti-inflammatory properties. 27. 28. Strong greater than bottom line complex carbs, like whole grains, legumes, fruits and vegetables have multiple health benefits. Simple carbs can be detrimental to your health. Excessive consumption of simple carbs like refined grains and added sugars harms your body. Below are some of the detrimental health effects of simple carbs. They contribute to overeating. Simple carbs break down quickly and cause a blood sugar roller coaster. Studies have found that these blood sugar spikes and crashes contribute to cravings, hunger and overeating. 7, 8, 29. High triglyceride levels Large amounts of refined carbs can lead to elevated triglyceride levels, which increase the risk of heart disease and type 2 diabetes 3, 30, 31, 32. Increased heart disease risk Sugar and refined grains increase heart disease risk. A study found those who ate the most refined grains were two to three times more likely to develop heart disease than those who ate the least 33, 34, 35, 36, 37. Increased risk of type 2 diabetes Excessive consumption of simple carbs can cause your cells to become resistant to insulin, which greatly increases your risk of type 2 diabetes 34, 38, 39, 40, 41. Sugar is addictive for some people similarly to recreational drugs. Sugar causes the brain to release dopamine. For people that are prone to addiction, sugar can be highly addictive 42, 43. Increased chance of becoming obese Simple carbs affect the levels of appetite hormones, making them likely to contribute to obesity 29, 44. Bottom line A diet high in refined carbs can have multiple negative health consequences. Which foods to eat and which foods to avoid carbs can be a healthy part of your diet if you choose the right ones. 
The healthiest carbs are from foods that are in their whole, unprocessed form. Complex carbs to eat the following foods are good carbs to include in your diet whole grains whole, unprocessed grains like oats, quinoa, barley and brown rice, legumes lentils, black beans, kidney beans, blackied peas, etc. Vegetables sweet potatoes, broccoli, green beans, carrots, asparagus, etc. Fruits apples, berries, oranges, kiwi, etc. Nuts and seeds almonds, walnuts, peanuts, chia seeds, etc. Refined carbs to limit or avoid these foods tend to contain mostly refined carbs and should be limited sugary beverages, soft drinks, sweetened tea, sports drinks, fruit juices, etc. Desserts and sweets, donuts, cakes, cookies, ice cream, candy, etc. White bread, this includes white wheat bread. White pastas, these are made from refined wheat flour. Bottom line complex carbs that are in the whole form are generally healthy foods that are rich in fiber and nutrients. Take home message complex carbs are far more nutritious than simple carbs. They are high in nutrients and fiber, and eating them on a regular basis can be beneficial for your health and waistline. On the other hand, simple carbs provide little to no nutritional value and should be avoided as much as possible.